Well, it has been known to rain on the odd day here at St. James's Park and rain in the forecast for this match. My name's Derek Ray. I'm delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Newcastle United taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to... So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting eleven. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Joel Matty plays alongside Virgil van Dijk in central defence. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And so the battle commences. Elliot. This is Salah. Into the advanced position. Explosive attacking qualities can be so important. Look no further than Mo Salah. Well, he's a good all-round player. When he's closing the ball down, he does it at pace. When he's linking up the play, he's good at that. But his real attribute and his threat is when he runs in behind defenders. That's when he's at his most dangerous. Wilson. Long start. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Fabinho and he has options available Fabinho it's a perfect challenge Callum Wilson this looks threatening could be oh fine stop But well, he's gone short with it. Long staff. Still could put it away. Almiron. Well, no danger now. Long staff. Joe Linton. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. Thiago. Here's Robertson. Beautiful pass. Still passing it around with authority. And cut again from the flank. Can he open the door to a potential goal? And Thiago. Timely intervention. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. Indeed, two trenchant sides not giving very much away at all. Fabinho. 
Lovely ball over the top. Well, this won't hurt the Liverpool cause. Corner awarded as they attempt to nudge in front. Let's see about the delivery. Save, but still a chance. Corner given. And there's the delivery. And a goal, courtesy of Mohamed Salah. His side in front, to their delight. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly, delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. The first half story has been written half time here at St James's Park. Well, he often grabs the headlines, and Mo Salah has been a big part of the story so far, Stuart. Well, Derek, after a slow start where he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on. Well, underway again. Advantage Liverpool after the first 45, but a long way from being settled. Effective looking pass. Teammates available. That's really good and effective physical play. Retaining possession proving difficult. Trippier. Fabian Scher. Callum Wilson. The Magpies pushing forward with options available. Joel Linton. On to Wilson. An alert piece of defending. So a half an hour remaining. Bodies forward and the break looks on. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. And cleared behind for what is going to be a corner kick. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Number 10, Alan Maximo. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming off the pitch, number 19, Harvey Elliott. To be replaced by... Short corner favours. Well, showing excellent judgment to intercept. Callum Wilson. Well, these Newcastle fans are demanding more from their team here. They need to find a goal from somewhere, and quickly. Well, potential danger. Trippier. Now with Sam Maxima. Went in strongly, decisively. This might be ideal for the counter. Trippier. 
Well, not long to go now, and for Newcastle, the question is this. Can they find an equaliser? Well, I think their forward play has been poor today. They've not had enough movement from the front players, and the midfield have been too safe with their passing. Unless that changes in these final few moments, they'll get nothing from this game. A creative look about this. Henderson doing well to keep possession. Salah! Oh, magnificent reaction. Coming onto the pitch. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Keen to take it short here. Henderson. And the last touch off the defender, so a corner coming up. Well, they're going for the short one. Alexander-Arnold. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. Callum Wilson. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. This could square the game. That is a tackle and a half. So the final whistle and no cause for celebration in the Magpies camp. What did you make of how it went? Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. Another more than effective night's work for Mo Salah. Your thoughts on his performance? Well, he was a real nuisance today. He always looked a threat, and of course he got the winner. He was probably the difference between the two teams.